Hello and welcome to Maths with Jacob. This lesson will focus on division, inverse of multiplication. It is very important to understand that multiplication and division are inverse operations. That is, if you carry out a particular calculation using multiplication, for example, division will undo the original calculations. Now let's look at some simple examples. Here we have a group of two apples and another group of two apples and another group of two apples. So altogether there are three groups each containing two apples or we can call them three lots of two apples. So three lots of two apples equals six apples. One, two, three, four, five, six. So altogether there are six. In a mathematical terms, that can be represented as 3 times 2 equals 6. Now, if we want to undo that operation, all we do, we just take the 6 and divide by 3. So you divide by the number of groups. There are three groups there. Okay, so you divide by 3 and that gives you 2. And that's the original number of apples in each group. So can you see how division undoes what was done using multiplication. Example 2. Two lots of four pens. So there's one lot, there's another lot. When you count those up, that gives you eight pens. Mathematically, two times four equals eight. If you take the eight, which is the total, and you divide it by two, that is the number of groups, you end up with four, which is the number in each group. And that's what we started with. So again, Division undoes multiplication. Example 3. Four lots of three birds. So there's one lot, two lots, three lots, four lots. And each lot or each group contains three birds. That gives you 12 altogether. Mathematically, four threes are 12. If you take the 12, which is the total, and you divide it by the number of groups, you end up with three which is the number in each group. Division undoes multiplication. Example 4, 5 lots of 4 rabbits, 20 rabbits altogether, 5 fours are 20, 20 divided by 5 equals 4, so 5 is the number of groups, and 4 gets you back to the number of rabbits in each group. Division undoes multiplication. Example 5, 6 lots of 3 cats, that gives you 18 cats, 6 threes are 18. 18 divided by 6, which is the number of groups, gives you 3, which is the number of cats in each group. Division undoes multiplication. And finally, the last example, 7 lots of 2 dogs equals 14 dogs, 7 twos are 14. 14 divided by 7 equals 2, which is the number in each lot or in each group. So division undoes multiplication. So basically, this lesson is showing you that multiplication and division are inverse operations. They undo each other.